hello everyone welcome back to a new video in this uh, in previous video we learn how to uh, design cup flower pot gasket and bevel gear etc in this video we are going to design a nut bolt assembly with the help of thread command many times we have to design this uh, nut and bolt let's see how to design this with the help of um, thread command in solidbox so we can uh, uh, design this type of uh, nut and bolt in solidbox uh, we can also make uh, here animations for more video about uh, solidbox please uh, subscribe to my channel and also uh, press the bell icon so you can get the latest notification about my channel so let's start today's tutorial first of all we have to select a plane then sketch and go for the hexagon take here a center point on origin origin and give it a dimension by smart dimension as a uh, hundred mm okay then make this uh, line of hexagonal vertical so we have to give here a relation first wait a minute okay then go for uh, next go for the extrude just uh, select here a uh, dimension give it here uh, 40 mm okay now sketch this uh, face and go for the circle select here origin point okay now circle and extrude this okay give it here uh, dimension first 70 mm as a uh, diameter and then extrude it to uh, as a dimension as uh, 300 mm now you can see here uh, two extrude uh, are done here first hexagon and then circle the cylindrical shape now go for the thread here on uh, hole wizard there is a hole uh, thread command just select first uh, here uh, first surface okay okay sorry now go for the hole wizard and there is a thread command select this and here we have to select uh, first uh, edge now select this and now select here uh, up to selection and select uh, up to which you want to thread okay you can see here and here you can uh, choose uh, thread uh, size standard size okay we are uh, choosing here m19 to 4.0 now go for the metric uh, tab and uh, now go for a thread or extrude uh, thread you can choose any or any of these and uh, there below is a uh, thread options uh, left handed or right handed we choose uh, right handed uh, threads now but it is uh, shows it says uh, unable to cut thread cylindrical uh, surface use extrude thread so use uh, extrude thread here choose uh, extrude thread below and now go for uh, done okay you can see here a uh, thread is done on uh, this uh, cylindrical surface yeah this is perfect this is a clear uh, bolt now but uh, there is a uh, problem on this uh, cylindrical shape this uh you can see here on uh, bottom side there is a not a uh, complete a uh, thread we uh, we are going to see this wait a minute here below okay i i will show you at bottom here 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 it is not uh, completely cut a thread, so.
so we have to uh, make uh, we have to eliminate this mistake so go to the um, thread again and choose here offset as a give it here dimension we can choose here 10 mm and uh, done it we have to choose a uh, second direction uh, now we've done it now you can see here it is a complete thread now yeah it is now you can uh, clearly visible on screen the bolt is done now full of this thread you can choose uh, any of these uh, option in thread now you can also uh, give it material like this uh, you just have to select here metals then uh, you can choose here any of these save this bolt and go for the nut you just have to uh, select this uh, head and sketch this uh, 70 mm extrude cut now go for the extrude cut so like this and now go for a uh, thread choose uh, here first uh, this edge and now up to selection second uh, surface now you can see here a uh, thread is uh, generated on this uh, internal part but here a problem you have to select here uh, extrude thread now the thread is done but here is uh, again a problem the thread is not complete so go to the thread edit this thread and go for the offset as uh, 10 mm yeah now done but here a problem there extra thread is uh, done on this uh, nut we have to cut this uh, extra thread so go for the sketch this plane on bolt and go for the circle give it dimension as a uh, 80 mm okay now go for a uh, thread cut extrude thread cut now done this okay okay you can clearly visible on screen the extra thread is cut now so again repeat this process here on opposite side go to the sketch make here circle give it dimension as 80 mm again go for the extrude uh, cut and ex uh, extend this now done you can see here on screen the nut is done now so uh, you can also choose here uh, material for this nut this polished steel brushed steel many uh, options are there so save this in, uh, bolt okay save this and now go for uh, assembly purpose so go to the new file then assembly and then ok it ok so let's browse uh, this component first so go to the browse and then select these uh, two components by control uh, pressing control ok now click on screen you can see here the, the both the components as, uh, are are uh, browse here okay so visible this uh, axis of this uh, two component like this 
here on uh, these co components and at the center there is a blue uh, center line it is a temporary axis okay now you can see here on screen okay go to the mate then uh, mechanical mate here on below side choose these two axis temporary axis okay at uh, below side okay now now go for the screw here on left side choose the screw give it here uh, distance as a 10 mm means it is a uh, pitch distance revolution okay done it you can see here here this is a uh, relation is added here as nut bolt screw screw bolt like this you just have to drag this uh, surface so it is um, see on screen you just have to uh, revolve this nut it will be uh, it will go upward and downward according to the direction in this way you can make uh, this type of poles and give it here um, mates so thank you so much for watching this video for more video please subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon so you can get uh, latest notification and also uh, like comment and uh, share this video to your friends this helped me a lot thank you so much see you in next video